rights. This country was founded. Citizens in it enjoying its rights. Quite frankly, I'm disgusted that we're even having a discussion about an autopsy because she was pulled over for something so insignificant and because of an officer who felt like maybe his ego was bruised and got in the way, not once did he ever say he felt threatened. But when you tell me that you're going to light me up, I feel extremely threatened and concerned, and I'm not going to get out of my car. Behind her? Yeah, she was an activist. Sir, do you think Sandy did anything? We're not in a position where we are going to say that it has been tampered with. We are not in a position where we can say that it has not. We simply don't know. I'm not a forensic media examiner, but now I know that we're going to have to get one. As an activist, was she involved in protests with an organization? Can you speak a little bit about that? Sandy Daly. What was she taking today? I can tell you that we take issue with the notion that she was suffering from depression. Support for her. In looking at the video, I've seen the video in its entirety. Sandy was pulled over for failure to proper indicate a proper lane change. And in looking at that, as her sister, I simply feel like the officer was picking on her. Point blank, period. And I personally think that is petty. Do you believe he pulled her over because she was black? I think he pulled her over because she was an out-of-state resident. That's what I think. Information regarding how the incident happened or might have information regarding keep hashtagging say her name because the minute that you forget her name you forget her character and that she was a person so that is my humble ass on behalf of me and my family i would like to see the video of her going into the cell because as i'm hearing 